Hey guys, Psychic Pictures here. Welcome back to more Pokemon Soul Silver. In the last episode, we went and went over the Pokewalker. We went over the Pokewalker and the features that it holds. And before that, we went and did the Safari Zone. This time, we're going to go into Mount Mortar, the waterfall cave inside. But. We're going to completely ignore it for now. Because there's something special over here. Check it out. It's apricorns, guys! It's apricorns! Hi! Ow! Hey! Hi, you seen? You here to battle me again? Suicune, how brave it is. How refreshing it is. How beautiful it is. How quickly it moves. Richard, you seem to be around where Suicune would appear. Well, that's okay. My desire to search for Suicune is far beyond yours. My grandpa was quite into myths. Myths. I've heard so many stories about Suicune from him. Suicune. I won't stop following you until I found out what you're after. You hear me? Okay. Apricorn time! It's an apricorn tree! It's a Gurn Apricorn! Obtain the Gurn Apricorn! And the... We obtained the... Pink Apricorn! Pink Apricorn! Alright. And here we have the... Yellow Ape... Yellow Apricorn. Yellow Apricorn. Yellow apricorn. Something like that. I don't know. Now, we have a super potion over here. And we could actually just bypass Mount Mortar if we wanted to. Because guess what? There's a Pokemon in the water. Goldeen. Level 20. Wow. That's actually pretty good. Moo. Moo. I have to send you out even though I'm riding on top of you. But there's... A oh, there might be a hidden item there. I'm going to check that out to see if there's a hidden item there. And if not, I'll just go back to the beginning of Mount, Mo Mount Mortar. Alright. So... Let's just run away from you. I was trying to get out uh, stuff about Mount Mortar. Is there something here? Two ahead. Oh, there we go. Max potion! Sweet. Anything else? Nope. Just another Pokemon. Or oh, Sea King! Huh! Interesting. And I have one. I have one. Uh huh. Come on, eh? Run away. Run away. Alright, let's just go over here and continue on with our adventure to Mount Mortar. And I'm going to have a guide in front of here because I don't like getting lost in dungeons. I can I easily get lost in the dungeons in this game, so I'm just going to go fiddle around and try to find my way. If I get lost, I can always look up the stuff in Mount Mortar. I don't think there's anything on Mount Mortar. There's nothing on Mount Mortar that we haven't seen yet. But, um, there is a Pokemon on Route 42 that we can obtain right now, technically. Mount Mortar! There's a Pokemon at Route 42 that we can technically obtain right now. And technically not. I mean, technically, yes. Because, um... It's only available in Heart Gold. I'm not going to go over the Pokemon, but... Well, not yet, anyway. Not yet I'm going to um, go over it. Oh, didn't mean to do that. Meant to keep right here. And there's no way up. No other way. Oops. Okay. Alright. Just go... Oh! Hello! 
Ether! Sweet. And I can't ride the waves because they are too low, I think. But what's the fun in that? Just riding the waves? Let's just keep going. Ah, we need strength. I forgot. Good thing... Miltank no strength. No. <gasps> Alright. Miltank made strength. Amane made strength. Made it possible to move barrels. Ooh, an Ultra Ball. Sweet. So, we're not fully able to explore this cave because we need a, um, another... We need two more badges in order to fully explore this place. Which, um, we're not going to get for a while. Just saying. But I'll come back to the cave, hopefully, if I remember. I'll try to come back to the cave when I remember. Hi there. Hey, huh. Hey, who? Hey, who? Super Nerd Marcus. Slowpoke. Hi there. Level 19. Uh, okay. Strength. <coughs> now, of course he had... Kosamane had to use a quick claw against a freaking Slowpoke. And it... Survived? Okay. Its speed fell and attack rose and defense rose. Fine, then. Roll out. Why not? <clears throat> Why not roll out? Come on. Okay, I know exactly where I am in here. And I don't... But I don't know where to go in this. Oh, well. I'll just wander around. Mane got 402 experience. Sweet. I mistook you for someone else. Nah, really? All right, let's go down here. Uh, are we able to go this way? No. That was all the area for that, actually. Repel's effect wore off. All right. Up here, we've got what? Mount Mortar. Oh, nice! Another Pokeball. Revive! We got a revive. Sweet. Alright. <clears throat> That's all that led to. Hmm. Hi there. I'm not losing this time. This time? What are you going on about? Pokemaniac Harrison. Nido King. This, this might be a challenge. Might be. Surf! I don't know how big your surf stat is, a uh, special attack is, but that actually did pretty good. I'm surprised this guy has a Needle King anyway. Needle King fainted. Nice. Needle Queen. I kind of figured that Pokemaniac Harrison would have a Needle Queen as well. Because <clears throat> if you got Needle King, you gotta have Needle Queen. Scratch it. Ah, scratch. Okay. Oh, that was a critical hit and did 10 damage. Oh no. Whatever shall I do? Nice! Grew to level 27. I lost to some kid? Yeah. You did. Dana. Let's just completely ignore you. Um, let me see something. Let me see, uh, I think. Yeah, this is the exit. Huh. That's the exit to Mahogany Town. There's so many other items that I haven't gotten yet. 
Or is it the fact that I can't get them yet? Oh, might as well put my item finder on. Oh, there's something over here. Something up, up there, actually. It's up here. Alright. Another super repel up. So that you guys don't have to... No. Not the tiny mushroom. So you guys don't have to, um... Ah, oh, it's down there. It's right there. If you guys can't tell, it's the r very last rock down here. I can't jump that, though. And I have oh, I have to go further that way in order to get there. <clears throat> and that's a rock climb thing. Let me just see where... I Let me just get myself situated here. So, uh... Hmm. It looks here that most of the stuff that I want to get is unobtainable. Uh, is unobtainable at the moment. So we actually cleared out the dungeon. We cleared out this dungeon. Come on, get down. Ah, it's up there again? Seriously? Nothing else in this dungeon. So, let's go outside. And here we have tall grass! Yay! There's one new Pokemon here. Which is only in... This is my secret place. Get lost, you outsider. So... Here... Um, oh yeah, you can attain Shadow Claw here, I forgot. I think I already got it, actually. I think I already got Shadow Claw. Yeah, I did. But, um, here in Heart Gold only, you can find Mankey. Mankey, I've used one in the past. It's a pretty good fighting type, but it's outclassed by a lot. It, um... Let me just get my notes out here. Oh no! In Arena fainted. But, overall, I think Mankey is... useful? But, it's not as useful as other fighting types out there. Uh, let me just see when it evolves. It evolves at level 28, which I did know that off the top of my head, I just wanted to... Uh, make sure. At level 28, it evolves into Primate. Primate, I, as I said, is a good Pokemon. I really like it. But I do admit that it isn't the most useful Pokemon. It definitely has its good points, don't get me wrong. It's a really good attacker. But it's not the best attacker out there in terms of fighting types. I should have used my Moonstone, says this guy. But overall, I think that... Um, <clears throat> that the Mankey family, Mankey and Primate, are very good and pretty useful in certain situations, but I wouldn't call them the best of the best. So here we're fighting a Quillfish! As you guys remember from when I went over it, when you, we got the good rod, it has Poison Point as its ability. It can potentially have it, I mean. It can potentially have Poison Point for its ability. That's why I'm using physical attacks on it, so that I can get poison. Let me guess. Oh, no, I didn't. I didn't get poison. Sweet. What? That's not right. Yeah, that is right. I did not get poison. I'll give you some items. Phone number? Yeah, why not? Do 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 just give me a phone number. <laughs> Alright, so... Switch you to... Black Rose is now in front. Alright, so... Let's continue on to Mahogany Town. Which is, um... Ha! Huh. 
which is right around the corner, actually. It's right by, right after Hiker Benjamin. Oh, nice, a diglet. Something to tear up with Magical Leaf. Alright! <clears throat> Alright, nice. Level 15 compared to level 26. Jeez. Sends out... Oh, you... You did not learn that I have the advantage with Grass type. Tee hee ha ha tee hee ha. All right, and now Doug. Ooh, Doug Trio, Diglett, Geodude, and Doug Trio. The <laughs> level 17 Doug Trio. Oh my gosh, it's stupidly fast though. It's stupidly fast, but that's it. Bye bye. Critical hit. <laughs> There we go. Ha ha ha, I lost. Yeah, you lost. Now, Mahogany Town to Ecritique City. We are in Mahogany Town now, and someone's blocking the door to the gym. You, sir, I have a beef with you. Have you seen this guy with a black cape? He's been going back and forth between here and the Lake of Rage, saying strange radio waves are being transmitted. Who is he, I wonder? Uh, if I'm recalling correctly, if you go into your radio here... Radio trans... Hear that? And it doesn't matter what station you put it on, you hear those strange things. You hear those strange... This strange music. And it's like, huh, what's disrupting the radio wave? What's disrupting the radio waves here? Hmm. I don't know. I don't know what it is, but we need to investigate. So let's explore Mahogany Town, and which is really small. And then we can go and... We can go and go up to the Lake of Rage and see what's up. Because we're the protagonist. We gotta do that stuff. Let's see what this is. Hi, I heard that a red Gyarados appeared at the Lake of Rage. That's odd, since even ordinary Gyarados are rare in that lake. My top radio show, I'd say Pokemon Music. Hmm. Interesting, when the radio waves are not that good. Hi. Hi, kid. I see you're new in Mahogany Town. Since you're new, you should try a yummy Rage candy bar. It'll be yours for $300. Sure, why not? Let's get one. Rage candy bar! And key items. I remember a person from as far as Kanto came to buy one a long time ago. I happened to have none in stock then. That person left rather upset. I felt kind of sorry for that. I don't want to upset you after buying one for me, but buying a Rage Candy Bar has nothing to do with whether I'll, uh, I'd allow you to pass through here. Johto has many places to visit, such as Lighthouse at Olivine and Pharmacy at Seanwood. Why don't you slow down and enjoy sightseeing? Hey! Bah, whatever. Bah humbug. Here we have a souvenir shop. Just a souvenir shop. All right. Hi there. The hehehe. Hey, the experiment worked like a charm. Magikarp are just worthless, but Gyarados are big money makers. Hi. Huh? You hear wind blowing into this room? That is just me whistling. Enough about that. Why don't you buy something? Let's see what you got. Tiny mushroom, Pokeball, and potion. Hmm. Nah. Let's. Just do that. Let's just not do anything. You hear something strange. Hmm. Hi there, welcome to my shop. Okay, that's it. Unless there's something in there. Nope. Nothing we can do in Mahogany Town. It's pretty boring. 
Nothing we can do here. It's just a place for now. It's just a place for now. So, next time on Pokemon Soul Silver, we will be headed up to the Lake of Rage and see what is going on there. See you guys next time for the Lake of Rage, which most people actually kind of already know what it is. <sighs> but we are going and going there next time. So this has been Psychic Pictures, and I'll see you guys next time while we ignore Ian. <laughs>